Hi, this is part two in the Beginner's Guide to X-Plane 10, and in this one, what we're going to do is we're going to download an aircraft and install it. First of all, you need to get a copy of WinRAR. I'll put a link in the description below. If you can't get WinRAR, WinZip will do, but one or the two. Once you've got that, download it, install it to your uh, desktop. We then need to go and find an aircraft. So here we are at uh, xplane.org. Um, use the uh, file manager to find a, an aircraft. And we're going to download the uh, Czech Sport, um, Czech Sport the, the, which is the second one from the uh, top. As you can see, there are a large number of aircraft for X-Plane 10 and X-Plane 9. Okay. So this is the one we're going to download. I'm just going to click on here. Uh, and it will open up to the download page. It should only take a second or two. Uh, and once we've got to the download page, we'll download it. Uh, this is what it looks like. There's lots of images here. I'm not going to look at them. I'm just going to download it. So I don't know what this aircraft looks like or flies like. It's the first time. So you click on the download button. In the bottom left-hand corner, you see of the screen that it's downloaded in a zip file or a WinRAR file. There it is, completely downloaded. Right-click on it and say Open. And WinRAR will open up and it will show you the file there. Just get rid of that dialog box, move that over there. And there you see the file, the aircraft highlighted underneath the cursor. So now we need to move that into the aircraft folder, which is really straightforward. So we just click on it and drag it over to the aircraft folder, which is over here. And I'll be using my general aviation folder. You see there are a number of folders with different names. That's my general aviation folder. Grab slide across let go and there you go it's installed i think that, that took less than five seconds in total so there's the aircraft so now what we need to do is we need to open up x-plane 10 to make sure that it's there and also uh, load it up and see if everything's okay as you can see it's all very quick very simple there's the aircraft i've opened up x-plane 10 and you can see a nice little picture of it very nice indeed so uh, let's get to uh, cardiff on uh, general aviation parking and load up oh here we are ga uh, unfortunately this aircraft hasn't got a 3d cockpit but what they've done is they've made it 2d but they put it over to the right of the screen a little bit so you get this really fantastic field of view through the cockpit you've got the glass reflective glass there in the cockpit it's all very very nice um it's a very fast little aircraft i have to say as soon as i opened the throttles it was away and uh, it was a, a real pleasure to fly but i think more importantly than anything else is this shows you how quickly you can download and install an aircraft into x-plane so let's just move out here to the runway i've got to be a little bit careful whoa this is fast looking right looking left Woo nearly ended up on the grass there uh let's slow down a bit let's put some brakes on just going to take off from runway 12 nothing fancy I uh, don't even know uh, what the wind is see you've got a GNS system there so you can uh, do uh, waypoints etc and a nice bit of a uh, glass uh, cockpit as well glass uh, compass and HSI as well so all very very nice and this is free don't forget this is complete freeware okay let's open the throttles up bit of flap as soon as we get to around about 60 knots, uh, we'll take off and be away, I hope, anyway. Once again, uh, a large number of free aircraft in X-Plane, and you can't really go wrong. And uh, this has just been a very short vlog on installing um, an aircraft into X-Plane. I hope you found it useful. Um, and the next vlog that I do in this very short um beginner's guide will be how to install scenery into x-plane it's very much the same as installing aircraft you just install to a different folder um, and it's the same with plugins but i will do individual vlogs for each of those so the next one i do in the series which will be who knows towards the end of this week it will be installing scenery into x-plane 10 and it's exactly the same process takes no time at all and uh, well We'll be able to uh, be an expert like many many other people very very quickly so i hope you find this uh, useful and we'll see you all again soon 
happy flying and don't forget if you've got any questions put them in the comments below or even better if you want to go to um, facebook.com slash groups slash xp dedicated join everybody there all the thousand plus members there and uh, we'll answer any question you have facebook.com uh, slash groups slash xp dedicated one of the most friendliest uh, Facebook pages around. Okay, there you go. It's time for me to go. Time to have a cup of coffee. I'll see you all soon. Cheerio. Yeah.